Hey there, thank you for joining me. It's time to jump into our truck again and explore the wasteland. But first, uh, let's see where we're at. We picked up a guy at the barn here. He doesn't have any spectacular stats, but we're going to drop him off in the other town that we're going to create. Or try to rebuild, I should say. Right here, Montemuerte. So we're going to drop him off there. Uh, let's see, we have some delivery quests. Uh, one. It's all the way in the other side here, so we're going to drop him off, and uh, it looks like we can get through here. No, this is not through, because I, I, I don't want to go deeper into the mountains, uh, because this has a side quest. Yeah, let's let's just go. Uh, I have enough fuel, we have enough everything. I'm also looking quickly at crafting. Two things we want to craft this episode, and that is the dining table. We need one more fiber. And the other one is going to be the middle cannon to make sure that we can then have the trucker too, which is Emperor, shoot twice as well. But let's get the show on the road. Map, reset. Um, I'm going to go first here. We have enough on us. Let me go to the store to make sure we buy some more water. Anything else we need here? No. Okay, let's go. Previous episode, it uh, was a lot of rain. We were able to get a lot of water, which is great. Whenever we need to drink or cool the engine. Because the engine automatically heats up faster in fall. I'm not sure what that's going to be in winter. You would think that it would cool faster. I've never done that quest before, so I'm not sure what to expect here. If you find any survivals, they'll supposedly pay you the rest of your fee. Okay, well, let's see what's going on. Pickup camp. That's not the quest. They seem to be resting. Let's do some recon. So we can chat with them. We get a cooking recipe, probably. Trade. Uh, trade. Do you have fibers? Ah, perfect. Um, I cannot craft that item yet because I have to go to the library to learn a blueprint, I think. I think. Yeah, okay. Uh, minus nine. That's set out. It should be cooling right now, right? There we go. Almost there. Oh. You have arrived in an iron bucket. Let's see what the quest is. In the ten years, I can't read it. In the ten years since the infected horde came through, the people of Iron Bucket, Bucket rebuilt their city not far from the ruins of the old one. You arrived at the school the old man told you about. Now a dilapidated ruin. Coming upon the storehouse, you find the door shattered into splinters. Skeletons and scraps of rotten fruit are strewn about the room. As expected. Judging by all these skeletons, the fate of these survivors isn't much of a mystery. Still, it's possible that some of them manage to get away. Should we scan the room or give up? Nah, scan the room. While sifting through the skeletons, you chance upon one that seems out of place. It's wearing a military uniform. Sewn into its shoulder is a patch reading Northern Lookout Garrison. Okay. So follow up quest scanner. Alright. Where is that at? Wait, you said it wasn't far away. Where are we at? Wait, you want, what? You want me to go there then? I, I have a quest here. 44 days, is that all we have? Okay, then, then we should be fine. I can't really pull the map any further here. This must be the edge, I guess. Okay, so we're gonna go there. Set. Well, we have this guy on. Ah, oh, crap. See, because now you have to go all the way back here. Uh, fuel, water. Okay, that is that is good then. That's good. How are we doing? Oh, you're a little bit tired, aren't you? Okay, let's go. 
And the engine is overheating again. Snow. Okay. We'll wait. It works out really well that way. And it doesn't affect our speed much. Oh, we're in the, in the wetlands. Cargo containers. You guys probably remember this one from uh, several episodes ago in the last episode. I think we encountered these three times, three times, in fact it jumped out. But let's do this. It's daytime. And then, you don't find anything useful. So again, why would I bother? Yeah, I don't like that farmer guy, so we have to kick him off. Uh, I don't need to do any foraging because I have plenty of shrooms on me. We're overheating again. It's a little bit of rain. By the way, you guys might have noticed I turned the music on. Uh, if it's annoying or anything, just drop me a comment. I think it's nice and relaxing. I wish there was all the music in the game, kind of like GTA. Just keep you awake. Uh, you have arrived in Far West Gas Station. Keep going west from here, you'll find absolutely nothing. <laughs> okay, we got the hint. Uh, fuel. We'll buy... Do we need tires? No, we're good there. Water. I'm gonna buy some more water. And what do you guys have abundant here? Leather. You hardly ever see that. What the, how much? I'll just take it with me in case uh, somebody wants to buy it somewhere. Anything that you guys want to have? Ointment. Nah, okay. Ham. I don't think I've ever seen ham in the game. That is a repair shop. Uh, before I want to try to sell something here, yeah, let's do this. From our excellently cooked food. Okay, we sold two salt roasted skewers for a total of 329. Let's do that again. So, that way you make basically a thousand bucks right then and there. Okay. Uh, okay, we want to hit some of these uh, these landfills. Frostfall Chaparral. Chaparral? Chaparral. Mm -hmm. Let's hit this one. That one. That one. And then that one. Let's go. Sketchy convoy. Oh! A convoy of vehicles comes into view roaring down the road. Uh, we better flee then. He's getting a little bit tired. Nah, it's the middle of the night. I don't want to get to that. Oh, okay, that's, we should be fine. I don't want to get here in the middle of the night. I want to do some proper searches. So, uh, let's go. How's the weather? Perfect. Uh, two and a half hours. It's gonna be middle of the night, isn't it? A little bit stressy here. Oh, we're not hungry anymore? It says that this leaves thirst, though. But, yeah. Unfortunate. 
So we arrived there. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, we'll just do it. I mean, who cares? Maybe we'll be lucky. Well, can't complain. Until you get a dust on. Uh, let's go to the next. How are we doing? Okay, we have enough. Let's go. So just want to make sure you don't want to get stranded, be stranded somewhere in a dust storm with nothing on you. Very high risk there. It's tricky to wait it out here. But it's daytime. We're fine. I guess. Yeah, we're really crawling here. Doesn't look like it's going to change anytime soon. Might as well camp. Uh, do a little bit of cooking, I guess. I'm, I'm a little bit crawling, so I'm not sure what to do. Can I do egg and vegetables? Is it gonna make like an omelette or something? Veggie omelette! We can do uh... And it's still storming outside, or dust storming. What does that give me? 95 and 28. And this one is 95 and 35. Uh, how to eat off? How to eat off? We need some more rations so they can keep eating the normal food. Well, we're probably going to end up with another attack here. Alright, well, well, at least we're going. By the way, I think when this fills up to the max, it automatically takes some of your water and puts it back to half. Why, oh, it's crap. Oh, okay. I thought we had to do a search here. Uh, then we go there. Let's see. 74 water, wastewater. I'm pretty sure it uh, automatically... It's not as if you blow up your truck or anything, as far as I know. No, it's still 74. What is it taking? How does it get it half down? There must be something I'm missing somewhere. Maybe it took the normal clean water? Five Kirill. Nice. That helps. Not hungry anymore. Almost there. Oh, no. Yeah, almost there, okay. And again in the evening. Well, we'll just uh, search for two and a half hours again. We got attacked. Gonna fight. So night penalty. Our accuracy is half of what it used to be. Hmm. Can't complain there. Uh, he, I'm gonna save the bullet. He, he can't really use it. shoot. I can do melee. So. No, we don't want the bodies. 
Nej, hun går under search. Så kan jeg også. And then we move on. Yeah, a little bit tired. A little bit stressy. How far is this? It's not too far, is it? Uh, stop. Camp. Just in case, I just want to make sure we can get some sleep in before that quest. Well, that is... that sucks. I don't know what quick battle does. Okay. Did we sleep? No, let's sleep. I want to be well rested before we dive into that quest. Wait, of all the decks, look at this. You arrived at the Northern Lookout Outpost and asked to speak to the commander. He asked if he knows anything about any survivors from the Iron Bucket School storeroom. After ten years, your hopes aren't high. Survivors? Sure, we've got one right here. Well, that was easier than expected. The commander points you to one of the sentries, a young man. Hey there. You tell him why you're here. Well, you found me. I survived the massacre at the Iron Bucket School storehouse. Is it just you? Yeah. It's clear he doesn't want to talk about this. But he continues nonetheless. Okay. <laughs> I had this little hidey hole through a crack in the wall. Nobody else knew about it. I hid in there when the infected broke in, when they killed everybody, except for me. I survived off of rats and condensation. I don't know for how long. I didn't dare come out, not while there were infected still around. One day a platoon from the Northern Lookout rolled through. They found me and now here I am. My friends, my classmate, the girl I had a crush on, I watched them all die. I still... The young man regains his soldiery composure and gives you a curt nod. Okay, sorry to hear about that. Okay, he doesn't like the teacher, so he wants to kill him. Okay, so he's talking about what the teacher did. So it's basically a coward to level the kids to die, it seems. He says it's very sorry. Um, yeah, I'm sure he's very sorry. The soldier looks off into the dustlands. It'd be a lot easier if he wasn't. Uh, I, I don't feel. I, I feel kind of bad asking for payment. Maybe we will get some virtue with this one. Oh, we don't get anything. Okay, great. Uh, let's do the upgrade. Farming, I guess. He actually had two trade points. I don't think anybody else has any. Nope. Uh, there's an in here. We don't really need that right now. We want to check the store, though. Anything we can sell here. We have rubber. I'm gonna sell some. Scrap weighs more than rubber, so. Ah, come on. We won't sell it then. Water, bread, anything else? Liquor. Can I sell this then? Wait, oh, oh, oh did I click wrong? Oh, they don't have that much money. Okay. Well, uh, I will sell f oh, about five bottles for you guys. Can I sell more? We have 3,300. Confirm. Anything abundant that we. Oh, pork and spices. Always good. A raw height. Um, I'm gonna buy 10 of those, or a couple of those. Let's see how long this goes. Let's do 10. Pork. We'll buy it uh, for 45 then. Uh, let's go to 50. Alright, do we want to buy some more spices? Get a good deal on this stuff, so might as well. Um, yeah, that should be it for now. So we find ourselves completely here on the on the on the edge of the map. It's horrible. I 
I'm looking for a kind of flour. Flour, salt, and bread. Is there anything in this area? Because this is getting annoying. I want to pick it up at a, a bargain price, of course. No luck uh, with the flour there. No luck with the bread. Salt. Yeah, right there. Okay, fantastic. Is this also? No. Okay. Um, let's see if there's anything we can do at the bar. The delivery. Great. I dislike everybody. People know that by now. Deliver we to Clunker Town. Clunker Town. That's on the way back. We have the weed on us. Okay, we'll just do it. Anything else? Buy junk, of course. Again, I let this like everybody. Uh, I'll just buy some scrap paper. Another potential delivery quest here. <laughs> Grudges and dislikes all over the place here. Middling Mountain Rest Stop. Uh, that sounds familiar. Yeah, there we go. Threat. I I don't even know where you get threat. I'm not gonna do that. They can get their own threat. I'm not gonna bother. So we have to go all the way back. So we basically salvage this all the way to level zero for now. Um I don't think you can get past here. The, oh, there is a way to get past here. Oh, that's good. That's good. I think. I would prefer to drive through the infected zone as long as it's flat. And then here. How are we doing? I would really like some more food and ammo. What's the forecast? Another dust storm coming in three hours. So we're going to be stuck next to the side of the road again. Um, a sickly looking fog. Yeah, let's uh, flee. You never know what that. And there's a dust. That subject was wounded. Oh, we were not fortunate there. Okay. Um... So do I have to do something like heal? Let's try again. Perfect. Any experience with the other guys? Because we're not leveling up very fast. We're on the plane, so we can actually do drive. But it's overheating the engine real fast here. Uh huh. Costing a lot of water and a lot of time, this. Static, so there's not even anything changing. Might as well camp. Sleep. I'll cook. I mean... It's just horrible, these dust storms. What can I make? Some shrooms, some spices, bulk. A little bit of stress going on here. It is brilliant because it actually lowers the stress more than it lowers the hunger. So you keep feeding this for a while and get all that stress down. Wait, it doesn't say anything about making him thirsty, does it? Is 
it does go up. They should kind of say that. Uh, that is interesting. Does it say that in the description? Because that's that is something that should be mentioned, I think. Hmm. Yeah, I don't care about this guy. But five hours. This goes way faster, look at this, how fast this goes. If compared to the time. Oh yeah, you can also compare it here. This is crazy. Oh, it actually stopped. Yeah, dust storms are really killers in this game. I do think you can craft something for that though. Uh, water. Dust filter. Hey, we can like, whoa, 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 whoa. I can actually craft that. Do we have room for this? Ah? Uh -huh. Oh, I didn't put it on the driving, I put it somewhere else, I think. Ah, oh, there, on the weather. Perfect. Uh, let's cool the engine a little bit. So that makes a big difference then. Should have looked into that for, uh, before. Where are we going again? Oh, yeah. So we have a quest here. We have the main quest here, but we're not going to go there. Uh, move on. Why would I interact with a whole convoy of vehicles? Engine failure? Oh, I guess I have to repair it then. Can I repair... Visit the city with a repair shop to repair the engine. Maybe it was from that fog that overtook us? Huh. That's forge. Nice. Can I forge again? Oh, there we go. A little bit getting tired here, Emperor. Yeah, I, I need to fix this. Our horsepower is... I think we're losing one horsepower here. I think we have five normally. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, that's going to be a long trip. <laughs> the Hitchhiker! A lone traveler by the side of the road waves you down to ask if you can give them a lift. I let him board. Ah, he stole something. What did he steal? One tire. There's a slight chance that they might actually join you, join your crew and might have some good stats too. That's worth it. We'll lose one tire. It's, it's not too bad. At least I don't, I, I don't think I've ever seen anything more serious. Like, they kill you in your sleep or anything like that. I don't think that happened. Cloudy might start to rain. I wonder if the engine failure was maybe the result of the overheating? I didn't notice that. I might have to look into this. Because I was thinking just use this water and you move on. Ah. Okay. So we want to give us some food. Uh, let's do stir fry meat. Here you go, guys. I've had it. Still quite a ways. 
I'm not sure if we can repair there. A lot of tired people. All right, you have arrived in Middling Mountain Rest Stop. We've been there before. Water axe or building materials. Civitas, milk sack. Okay. So this is where we have a quest. Can we go here? Somehow. Nope. I have to go this way. Oh, we want to drop that clown off first. See, I, I don't even know... If this is really flat here, you know? I, I think it's just mountains. Or hills. Uh, store anything we can sell here. Nah, I'm gonna keep the fruit. Anything we can buy. Water eggs. I'll just buy more water. We can't repair here, that's painful. Uh, any good deliveries? Where's that at? Pass gas. That is really close to our... Okay, okay. We'll pick it up. Uh, any other deliveries here? We cannot speak to them. Matt, okay. Very hard. Deliver ore to car... Okay, where's that at? Whoa. No, I'm not gonna do that. No junk? Oh, he's, he didn't eat. Hold on. Let's give some this. Interesting. It must be something... Because normally... As you can see, there's a little... Lowers the hunger by 86, but it's not giving him that number at all right now. It's only half. Rating efficiency. Appetite 10? Where did that happen? Huh. How did that happen? I don't think he had that in the beginning. Okay, let's go. That's kind of strange. I have to uh, check my previous episodes because I'm pretty sure he didn't have that in the beginning. Let's collect some rainwater. There we go. And immediately is beautiful weather. Okay, hold on. Didn't I change anything about automatically eating? Why are they not eating the stir fry? Oh, I think it did turn it off here. That's a problem. I turned it off here. I thought it, I actually turned something off onto the items itself. Hmm. That's. I should have bought some rations there if they had them. Whoa. That's quite a waste. We'll just search it. Ammo! Nice. Yeah, 
Yeah, it looks like there was a little bit of a flat spot, did you see that? So this might actually be plain flat terrain here in between those those peaks. Okay, we have plenty of water, but I really need some rations. Bad weather, engine failing, overloaded, and terrain. <laughs> Almost there. Been a long journey. I'm at city. Uh, we had the water pump, right? We haven't upgraded anything here yet? I thought we did. Probably not. Okay, let's put that farmer on there. So he'll actually get uh, water 6 per day. Perfect. Now he has a skill point? Uh, how does that work? Okay, let's assign him again. Uh, for the rest, I, I'm not going to upgrade anything just yet. Let's get these building materials in the city. Uh, we don't have anything else here, no. Is there anybody we can trade with? Uh, Mount, Mountain Way, they actually demand 10 water per week. Well. Because you only need at least one good to fulfill the agreement. Perfect. We'll take some sleep. I hope they have rations here. Because this is getting really costly, of course. Let's go. I'm going to stay out of this area, by the way. These hills are driving me up the wall. It's just so slow. Wreckage of an airplane. The, the charring on the hull indicates there was a huge explosion. Let's, let's just search it. Another waste of time. See, it turns that auto eat off, so I basically have to open up all that food here, which I really didn't want to do. Let me cook. Kitchen, cook. Uh, chicken, salt. Let's use some spices. Oh, got interrupted again. Okay. Let's open that up at least for them. Okay, that's all opened up here. Perfect. Um... Yeah, let's get out of these mountains. How about a dust storm? Light rain, okay. Could get heavier. Light rain is okay. It doesn't do much to us. Ah, out of the mountains. We turn that quest in. Let's first of all repair. Everything is fine. Tires. Do we have anything that we need here? Let's buy five tires. 
chicken, fruit, shrimp, pheasant, water. We have plenty of water now. Do we have rations? Ah, crap. We have salt, anything? Hmm. Also, this place doesn't have a bar or anything. So, where's the nearest place for rations? Uh, several. Wheat, sugar cane, and tires. Uh. How to eat? And let's go. I don't know what happened to his appetite because he's eating so much now. He doesn't have a trade or anything. We never do the Oasis. It's a complete waste of time. I'm gonna get a little bit tired here. So we should be arriving there at about 18 hours, as long as there's not gonna be a dust storm. Oh. Probably what damaged our engine. Me letting it simply overheat, thinking it's gonna take care of itself with the water and... I don't think that was smart. That's probably what happened. Abandoned AFV. Yeah, let's search it. Again, don't find anything useful. It's a recurring theme. Not sure if maybe one of my skills is too low overall. No again. We are back in Tyrannus. Now they have rations, don't they? Yeah. Alright, so we have to buy a whole bunch. Let's buy a hundred. Uh, ammo. I would rather have a deal, so I'm not gonna do that. Mat kit, mats, wood, rations, building materials. Anything you want to buy from us? Quail, I guess. Oh, I have zero, okay. Good relations. Nah. They have books, but yeah, they're not on, not on sale. Um, wow. Okay, well at least we got our uh, rations back up, fuel, ammo is fine now, we've got plenty of tires. I'm gonna leave it here guys. It was a little bit of a slow episode because of the dust storms all over the place. The previous episode was all the rains. And next episode is probably gonna be all snow. But uh, I do thank you for watching, catch you guys next time. Bye bye.